I know what you're thinking. I'm good and powerful, apparently. Jealous? After the surprising success of the live-action movie Sonic the Hedgehog in 2020 and Sonic the Hedgehog 2 in 2022, it seemed that the character outside of the games would have to rely on the cinematic franchise. But, oh were we wrong. Hello and welcome back to Slurp. Before we jump into this video, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to keep up to date with all our latest content. Sonic the Hedgehog is already having a huge year, and it's only about to pick up the pace. Netflix has recently announced that Sonic is set to speed onto Netflix in a brand new upcoming Sonic animated series titled Sonic Prime, due to hit the streaming service in 2022. Netflix has recently invested a lot into video game adaptation over the years including Skylanders Academy and The Witcher, and this train is showing no signs of slowing down. So, what can we expect from the upcoming Sonic Prime? Here's everything we know so far. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, lift off. If you've been living under a rock these past few weeks, you may have missed the first footage released by Netflix that included the first glimpse of the voiceover actor who will be starring as Sonic in the series, Devin Mack. In addition to Mack, we also have other undisclosed voice actors rumored to join the cast including Ashley Ball, Brian Drummond, Shannon Chan Kent, Ian Hanlon, and Adam Miranda. Although Mack is the only official confirmation after he took to Twitter to respond to the announcement to say, Wait, what? If I could be serious for a minute, Real talk, I'll be joining the ranks of some amazing talents who have and will still be performing this legendary character in the video games and movies. So I'd like it to be perfectly clear that they ain't going anywhere and I wouldn't have it any other way. They've been doing amazing work for years that I legit can't wait to hear more of. I like to think of this all as its own new little pocket within the whole grand scheme of things and it's been an incredible blessing, it's been an honor, and it's been a little scary all at the same time. Uh, I say that because I understand just how much these characters mean to so many people. And I can tell you there's a lot of very talented people working on this show who are really passionate about just telling a great story with lots of great action and twists and turns and loop-de-loops and a lot of surprises that I know I didn't see coming. It definitely fills fans with confidence to see Mac has a lot of respect for the character and franchise, so we're excited to see what he will bring to Sonic. Are you excited to see Mac take on the role of the Blue Hedgehog? Let us know in the comments below. With Sonic Prime expected to release 24 episodes in the first season, there's been a lot of fan speculation about what we can expect from the plot. According to the press release for the show, we're going to be heading on a journey through time and space. In May of 2021 during the Sonic Central presentation, producer of the show Joe Kelly gave fans a brief synopsis of the upcoming show saying, Sonic will be thrusted into a high-speed adventure through the strange and mysterious Shadowverse. It's up to Sonic to save the universe and along the way experience moments of self-discovery and redemption. From Kelly's comments, it seems we can expect a multiverse situation to happen in the upcoming series. I mean, it's the in thing at the minute. But, it's definitely an interesting concept that could see different versions of Sonic coming together in one place. It would be pretty epic to see Sonic Boon, anime Sonic from Sonic X and the 2022 movie version on the screen together. To further support the theory of a multiverse plot, concept art was leaked that appears to show multiple versions of Eggman, a jungle-dressed Amy Rose, and a Kitsu render of Tails. But, even from the little confirmed information we have, the multiverse plot sounds epic and we'd love to see how this would play out on screen. And regardless, I'm sure we can expect Sonic and his friends up to their usual antics. Chasing gold rings and of course, the hedgehog running at Sonic speed. From the concept art released, we know that we can expect an appearance from Tails, Amy, and Eggman. But, it's still unclear as to who will be voicing these characters. It's rumored that none of the actors from the games or films will be featured in Sonic Prime, due to it being a Canadian production so the project has taken on actors that live in the country. Sonic's had many companions and sidekicks along the way in previous animations including Tails, Knuckles, and Amy Rose to mention a few. And of course, the iconic villain Eggman AK, a Dr. Robotnik has always appeared as the antagonist, so based on that and the leaked concept art, we're pretty certain to see him return. But with Sonic Prime still on the horizon, we'll be patiently waiting for more updates from Netflix and when we can expect it to be hitting our screens. What are you hoping to see in Sonic Prime? Let us know in the comments below. 
Thanks for checking out our video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more awesome content. And we'll see you in the next one. Make sure I'm not alone The story is difficult But how was I to know